For the following problem, it says, suppose log base x of 8 is equal to b, where b is a positive real number and x is greater than 0. Solve for x as a function of b. Find a value of b such that the solution x of the equation log base x of 8 is equal to b is a positive integer. Okay, so this is a really, really long explanation for what they want us to do. But essentially, they, what they want us to do is they want us to take log base x of 8 is equal to b, and they want us to solve this for x first. All right, so for solving this for x, we're going to use our log rule that says that we can take our base, raise it to this power, and set it equal to this. All right, so that would look like x raised to the b power is equal to 8. Our log rule says that we can do that. Now, they want us to solve for x. We don't have it solved for x. We have it solved for x to the b. Now, if we want to get rid of that exponent as a b, what we actually need to do is we need to raise it to the power of the reciprocal of b in order to get it to cancel out. So if we take b all right, and write it as a fraction, that's b over 1. If we take the reciprocal of b, that would then be 1 over b. And this is what we're actually wanting to multiply together. So we have x to the b. I want to raise it to the reciprocal, to the 1 over b. And if you remember your exponent rules, if I have b, then raised to the 1 over b power, the, po the power rules for exponents says that we need to multiply these two together. Right. But also, if I set the left-hand side and raise it to the 1 over b power, I need to take the right-hand side and raise it to the 1 over b power. Now, on the left side, we need to simplify that multiplication. b times 1 over b, this cancels. It goes away, which is why I did that. And it left us with x. On the right-hand side, we have 8 raised to the 1 over b. So this is... Um, when it says solve for x as a function of b, this is what they're looking for. We solve for x as a function of b. They want us then to find a value of b such that that solution is a positive integer. Right? So they want us to just tell them, hey, what can we plug in for b that would make this equal a positive integer? Right? So we need to take a look at what we actually have here. So we have 8 to the 1 over b power. We can really, there's a lot of things that we can plug into b to make it an integer. I mean, we can use a 1, right? If we say that b is equal to 1, we would then have x is equal to 8 to the 1 over 1, and that's simply just x is equal to 8. That's a positive integer right there. There's a few other numbers that you can probably plug, in, plug into b. Um, and get this to equal positive integer. One is the easiest to use, so that's what I'm going to use for this one here. So our equation is x is equal to 8 to the 1 over b, and I'm going to state that b is equal to 1 is what's going to give us a positive integer here. Otherwise, that's it for this video.